after just one hour of the one that's coming up, you'll feel a difference. That's right. In tonight's workout of the week, we'll show you how to tone up using the dancing pole. Well, uh, speaking of dancing, we were a little bit hesitant to try tonight's workout of the week. That's because when you hear pole dancing, a lot of think, people think of, well, one thing. But this is different. It doesn't involve dancing, and it shatters some stereotypes about the pole. Keep it here. Workout of the week is next. Oh, it swept the nation. It swept the world. They're everywhere. Pole dancing is great exercise, but if you're a little shy about actually dancing, this may be the workout for you. It is called Pole Blast. It's a way to apply the pole to your fitness routine. Tonight's workout of the week is new at 5. And it's fun, upbeat, let's rock it. Jennifer Keys is clearly comfortable on the pole, and she should be. She's been dancing and training others for nearly two decades. A lot of people are alarmed by it first here, and they're like, oh, there's no way I could do that. I don't want anyone to think that they can't do it. Um, so this pole blast class is the way for people to get in here. It begins with what Jennifer calls juicy joints. The joints are stimulated, which keeps them loose. Try to grow a little bit higher and taller with that kick. Once we're warmed up, we move on to some exercises Jen's designed to give us perky pecs. Walk it out, feel your weight come forward off of those feet. And lean legs. Really tighten up these butt cheeks, hug them in. A few of these and our quads and hamstrings are screaming. Push, push, oh my goodness, don't stop. Jennifer says this is a good introduction to the pole. It's not necessarily used for dancing. Instead, it's used to improve balance, strength, and flexibility. This is where our ab work comes in. Toes up to the sky. And the helicopters, harder than you might think. Come on, abs in, abs in. So is simply hanging from the pole. Hang, baby, hang. One, two, three. This isn't something that I'm doing um, outside of my fitness. I, I do it for fitness, and I want everyone else to come in and just experience it. And if you master these moves, you may want to take it to the next level. Or not, you know, it doesn't matter. You don't have to take the pole glass class into our dancing choreography if that's not where your comfort zone is. It's fine. It's fine. You're still going to get a great workout, great conditioning. And eventually, a great dancer's body. And if you'd like to learn more about the Pole Blast workout, go to our website, whotv.com. Click on the As Seen on 13 tab and look for the workout of the week. You'll also find a link to Keys Camp for more workout ideas.